Hello YouTube and welcome to my um, Sony Vegas basic intro guide. So what I'll be doing today is just showing you how to make a basic intro with Sony Vegas. This is Sony Vegas Pro 9.0 and it's very simple to, to use to edit your videos. So what you want to do first of all is download a template from aqul.com slash templates. Um, the template I'll be downloading is the Elements Intro Promo Trailer. So just click on that. And as you can see, there'll be a download button. Yep, yep. So it's after you've downloaded it, it should look something like this. So, yeah, I'll just be using the templates from this to make my um, intro today. So, first of all, what you want to do is drag the audio. Here it is. Just drag it and place it in one of the volume layers. What you can do from here is make it as long or short as you want. Right, so that will do for now. And now I'm just going to put an effect in. So you can choose from the many effects there is this lens flare, underline, sparks. So I'm going to use sparks. So drag that and I'm going to put it in layer 3. As um, layer 1 would be Layer 1 would be like something saying your title of your video because if you put this in layer 1 it will overlay your title so now if you want to un you see this has audio group as well if you want to ungroup this from its audio just press U and now click on the audio and you should be able to delete it without deleting the sparks now what you want to do is um let's say click on the first bar and I'm going to put in my title so insert tax media let's just say Mr. Productions just going to highlight that, change the size down and placement, this is when you drag it about so you can put it anywhere so I'm just going to leave it there and that's that done and we'll put in another one somewhere here. This will be presents. So I'm going to make this smaller. Um, yeah, about there. And what you can do here is if you drag this over, that will give you an overlay. So now you just want to click that go video event. Oops, sorry. Click this and go generate media. I'm just going to change the position of it to about down there. <laughs> and let's um, see how it's like. So it's looking good so far, but I think that's a bit too long. So what we're going to do is just click there and make it shorter yeah so I want the sparks to end when it says presents so that's, that's when my sparks will end now I'm just gonna now I'm gonna put in my um, video effects for my next portion I'm gonna put lens flare 1 there we go and again what I'm gonna do is press U should ungroup it and delete that and make that fit with that audio then I'm gonna insert a text media and I'm gonna say Sony Vegas intro example so I'm gonna split this into two lines there we go and make that smaller Then what we can do here is go to effects and I'm going to highlight this in purple. Yeah, that looks quite good. When you're done, edit the placement such as just above that line and you're more or less done. Right, so you're more or less done with your intro but what I want to do is bring it a step further and um, and put a picture into it. So let's see. Um, right, so I'm just going to go to my documents. 
And what I'm going to do is drag this picture into there. So from here, I'll be able to drag it into here. But if you put this on a layer below your effects, you see what happens? It becomes it comes out behind it. So what you want to do is replace that with your effects. There we go. Now what you should see is that, but the image is too big. So what you do is click on this event pan crop. So it, and click on this little dot here. If you do that, what you're going to do is you're going to be zooming in on it because that is the area of which you'll be looking at. So what I'm going to do is just, I'm going to zoom all the way out. I'm just going to zoom out a lot more than that. And what we can do now is when it's done, move this. So moving it, so when you see these four arrows, if you move it, you'll be moving the image around. So I'm just going to drag that, um, place it somewhere here. Yeah, that looks good. So now I'm going to just click on this, if you can see text is overlaying that, so what you want to do is just go edit generate media placement and drag it out of the way. Whoops, and there you go. You've got your intros. Right, so I've just um, rendered my video and this is how your intro should look when it's done. Yep, so hope that helped, and um, please like and subscribe, thank you.